This is the Supreme drop today. First Supreme drop back after four months. Let's get this pre-Supreme breakfast going. Put some mozzarella in that bitch. Some bacon. Breakfast finished. Let's go cop some Supreme. Nothing's happening. Okay. All right, lit. I was just complaining. Actually caught what I wanted to cop. Obviously, I wanted the Motion Logo t-shirt. By the way, sorry if I'm speaking funny. I think my wisdom tooth is literally coming through. Like, my two gums are fucking, like, touching each other. It's killing my side of the, my face. I meant to cop the Motion Logo t-shirt first, but took an L on that. Mesh shorts. These shorts are fire. Um... I actually asked someone in store to get me them, but I just caught them online, so I'm gonna tell the guy in store that I don't need them anymore, because we caught for retail, retail. For retail, of course, for retail, boys. <laughs> get ready, and we're gonna head to London. We're gonna head to the Supreme store for the first ever Supreme in-store drop in about four months. Let's go. Shoes, cargo pants. Vintage my Tyson tee, dual bag for my wallet, phone, keys, and everything like that. <sighs> it's that lad's drip. You're lying, bro. <laughs> You're chatting shit. You're chatting rubbish. Go on, back out then. Yeah, fucking <laughs> screenshot you bought. Go on and out. And now it's time to go to London. Soho, let's head to Supreme. Let's see what they're dropping. Well, I already know what they're dropping. They're dropping this. I put it up on the screen. But let's go to Supreme, check it out, see what people are copying, see what's reselling, see what's popping. Jack Harlow style. This has got to be the worst possible weather that we could have asked for to go back to Supreme. I mean, it's our in a thunderstorm. Mm. Great. Parking itself. I'm literally not doing anything. Why do I feel like it's gonna curb the wheels? Shit! What a vibe! Oh! What was that? Parking assist finished. I don't know about that. I'm still hanging halfway out the road. Anyway, Mercedes did their best. <laughs> now I have to fix it. <laughs> Just got to Supreme, and as you can see, there is no line whatsoever. They're basically, there's new rules now. Can't enter the store, one without a mask. They're having like 12 people in the store an hour, literally 12 people. So the, every, it's dead, like there's literally nobody here. Boss man returns. Big brother. They had a lunch break today. Which, I mean, I've never heard Supreme having a lunch break. They, I think they're on lunch break right now from 1 to 2. No one really has anything right now. The, the, there's no one here. So it's, it's weird to see a Supreme drop like this, but I'm going to try and show you more. What are you saying, G? No, no, elbows, mate. Elbows. How's the Supreme drop been? What have you copped? The plug is here. I still didn't go inside. Or, uh, but did you cop anything? I didn't have a number. I'm just waiting for my guy. The plug's it's plug. Three o'clock, yeah. I need to buy all of the keys. All the t-shirts, yeah. every colour. Alright, in a bit, 3 o'clock, mate. Take care, bro. Peace. What did you cop today? Got the they got BB Simon, Simon yeah, belts? I got two. Yo, chat. Yeah. What I about got, tees? I got the Motion and Lizard. What t what colour Motion logo did you get? Oh, black, medium. They restocked BB Simon belts. Yeah, that's a Motion. Motion low. Oh, oh. So, guys, here's the Motion logo. My man here's copped a meat. Were you gonna cheeky resell or? Uh, keeping this. Gonna one. keep the black ones. Fair enough. Keep the that's, black, you can wear it always. Good. And then, what's this? Lizard t-shirt. What, what, what are you thinking about the lizard, mate? You're thinking about the lizard. Not feeling, Not feeling the lizard. <laughs> Fair enough, anyway. 
Nice one, man. Thank Congrats you. on the cop. Now we've come back after the lunch break. There are people clearly uh, coming out the store. My man's gone and copped a Black Motion logo. So I wonder if they've got any of like the other colors, yellow, green. As you can tell, no queue, no queue. So it is, it's crazy to see a Supreme drop like this with literally nobody here. Supreme literally doing a Motion logo drop, which is a pretty hype drop and there be 10 people in total in this entire area. Like, it's mad. Honestly guys, I thought I was gonna be showing you like a crazy drop, everyone's come back and, and all of this and there's gonna be loads of people copying. Bro, look, look, nobody, nobody, nobody. I've managed to secure one t-shirt, either green or gray. So I'm gonna go and pick it up literally right now. These are the stickers that dropped, what's this? Never mind, fuck the fucking bullshit politics as usual. Lizard, and then obviously box logo. But not a bad uh, little sticker pack there. This hat dropped today, and it's got like, I don't know how you explain it, that material. But What's it called? Ventic Venticular. Venticular, there it is. The real one? Oh, you thought they were chunky donkeys? I've got, I've got so you got so many crepes, you don't even know what's what. Oh, ben and Jerry's. Oh, I need this crepe, you know that. What size is it? An eight. Oh, I've got double in your pit. Stop it. Jeez. They look so much nicer in person. You know. About politics, don't get involved in that, mate. Lizard tea. Oh, yeah, well. What the lizard tea? Yeah. It's all right. Yeah, well, who's this geezer? Who's this geezer here? My fucking mate, isn't it? Your boy. My boy. And then uh, whatever this is, matching t-shirt. It dropped a lot of tea. How many teas they dropped today? Fucking eight. Eight. Supreme. Anno. Dominini. Oh, Jesus, you got. This is a pit, pit ball tee. Yeah, that was hard. We've made a big shot. I see, I saw, I saw Vivian's shot. pick with this, with the actual pit ball. That's pretty hard. I'm gonna yeah, put it on the hard. screen right there because I rate that, that went hard. Yellow motion logo. Jeez, how many tees here? 20 plus tees in here, to be honest. When they do this pink and it's like pink, like pinky gray, it looks a bit weird. Don't know if I rate that, to be honest, that weird pink color. More politics, lizard. Another one. All the same, just different colours. So yeah, I showed you every single t-shirt. Anyway, so I secured this tee. I got the uh, green motion logo because I'm kind of wearing green vibes today. Camo, green dunks. So I'm going to shoot this and then I'm actually going to sell it. I'll tell you guys straight up. I'm going to sell this one. And then I also bought a grey t-shirt as well that I haven't picked up yet. I need to pick up in a little while. And uh, I'm going to keep that one because grey you can wear with everything. We just pulled up to shoot the uh, motion logo. This is the green one. I'm just going to put it on real quick. And there we go. What's the vibe? What's it saying? Bit fire. I actually Get like it. Excels. This is an XL. I know it looks quite big, huh? Get the chain out, yeah. Yeah, chain out. I like it. Now I'm now I'm thinking actually, do I want it to keep? I thought you were keeping. No, I was gonna sell this green one and keep the grey one, but now oh, I've got this one nice. on. I mean, green's nice. So now green is nice. I think spend green. More money, yeah? <laughs> See? Okay, so I just finished my fit pick in the green motion logo and make sure you guys if you are not already following me on Instagram following me make sure you go and follow Supreme was super super dead. I've actually just been into Selfridges just to check it out as I always do if I'm in the area But there is a new store on the block. It's right behind me It's called Boutique Baller and it's literally like Selfridges is right there It's like a 10 second walk literally from Selfridges So if you guys are ever in Selfridges shopping around make sure you cross the road and come and check out Boutique Baller I have never been into this store before they opened this store up just as lockdown happened So it was a bit of an L but now we are finally allowed to go into the store check it out you guys are gonna come with me. Let's hop into Boutique Ball. to check out the store no one here music office like a ghost town in here but um, yeah we have the store to ourselves right now so I'm gonna try and show you guys as much as I can and all the stuff I like about this store and uh, yeah we're just gonna check it out so when you first come in you've got the uh, I suppose the gray old section so obviously you've got all the off look at these bro. how much are these Ooh. 
But what are these shoes going for right now? Four racks, and this is a small size, four or five racks. But I remember copping the shoe for 800 pound on release day. Now it's in the grail cabinet. All the Travises, from the lows to the highs, to the sixes, to the two. What do you think of these, Kedon? Honest opinion? Nah, not for me. Not for you? No. I don't know, the other day, right, I was thinking like, I have every Travis Scott shoe apart from this. So does that mean like, I need to buy this shoe? And then I thought, actually, I sold the sixes, so I don't have every single one, so now I don't need this one. So that's like the uh, off-white cabinet with uh, some other little grails in there. We'll close that and uh, try not to smash the door. This is Yeezy wall, pretty much Yeezy wall, all the Yeezy. Bro, like, there's so many Yeezy at this point. I don't even remember like, these shoes coming out. Like, I remember these, but bro, they're all just so similar. But regardless, at Boutique Baller, they got them all. And I think this is like, kind of women's Jordan 1 section. These are women's Jordan 1s. These are women's Jordan 1s. These are actually fire. Like, I, don't, I think they're called Panda. They actually slap like fur on them. These are hard. That's the sneakers, I suppose. They got another sneaker section back there. In the front of the store, they have V-Loan. Like, they told me V-Loan's selling really, really well for them right now. Those and they've got some off-white bits. This cabinet right here goes crazy. They've got all the Swarovski box logos, the hoodies. They've got a signed pair of uh, Virgil off-whites, the OGs. Got a few bits of like Supreme Louis Vuitton wallet. I actually had that wallet before. This hoodie is nice. Is that Supreme? Yeah, Nike Supreme. I don't even remember this dropping. Nike, well, I do, but I, I forget that they did a hoodie. It's like leather at the yeah, front. Yeah, expensive looks, retail yeah, then. It's definitely like 200 retail or something like that. But yeah, they've got all the Supreme stuff. Supreme isn't like reselling like crazy anymore. And that's the good thing about this store is they don't just have Supreme. Like they've got loads of other stuff. They even have a downstairs section with like more Louis Vuitton and other designer brands that we'll check out. Bro, look at this bag. Look at this bag. That's hard. That bag, when you walk around with that bag, you probably got the bag. Um, <laughs> yeah, Travis Scott merch. Obviously, Travis Scott is popping right now. All his merch is going crazy. All his shoes are going crazy. I would probably say he's like the most popular guy in streetwear right now. Like everything he touches, everything he does, selling out crazy resale prices. Like this t-shirt right here goes so hard. I bought all of this stuff and it took like six months to get to me. So that's the good thing, like if you don't want to wait the six months, bro, just come into a store like this and pick up these merch tees, like they're not that expensive. But uh, yeah, the store looks pretty freaking swag from here. These dunks, these dunks are doing really well right now, like resale wise, these are going crazy. But yeah, that's like the front end of the store. Again, they have like another little grail section. Bro, these Mars yards go for crazy money. I think they got them in there for like 3K or 4K. Crazy. This part of the store is actually pretty freaking swag. You can sit on here, mate, try on all the shoes, see what you want to cop. And honestly, there is something I do want to cop today. I showed you guys earlier on in the vlog, but they have these in here. And I saw them earlier and I was like, yo, I slept on this. Well, I didn't sleep on this crap. I wanted this crap. I took an L. I entered every raffle, took an L. And I just, it hurt me to like, Pay resale. I kind of just want this shoe in my collection. In this store as well, they've got like loads of these like rare cause toys. They don't just have like the regular regular ones, they've got some big boy ones. This one just really Did you see the size of this thing? Yeah, let me grab the camera. Look at the size of this thing. He's huge, and then he's got a painting as well. He's carrying his painting home. This collectible item goes crazy, but yeah. This section of the store is fire, and I think I'm actually gonna ask one of the employees if I can try on these chunky donkeys, because I kinda want them. Mind if I try these on in uh, eight? Of course. Sweet. Cheers, man. Appreciate it. A few moments later. Here you are. This house, mate. Does it smell like cookie dough? <laughs> or caramel choo choo? <laughs> but no special box, because I'm too broke for a special box. The special box is going for like three grand right now, which is insane. But here's the pair. I think I'm gonna not struggle to take them off, but kind of like I don't want to take them off. I think I think I might have to cut. I'm gonna ask the owner what he can do because might need to cut like that. So one thing I'm actually gonna ask them right now is the craziest item that they have in the store, like the most expensive item that they have in this store. Because you guys probably want to see that. I low key want to see that as well. So I'm gonna go and ask them right now. You got the bag. You know what? When this came out, I don't know if I've ever hold one of these. What do you reckon if I go down to Monaco like this? How much is this? 15,000. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Ouch. 
Indeed. But they got the backpack as well. Oh shit. Walking down uh, London, mate, after you guys come here and cop these two, 30 rags, then you can walk around Selfridges like this. In Boutique Baller, they actually have a section downstairs, which is like, no one's really quite allowed in yet, but uh, they are going to be opening it soon. It is currently the members floor, so uh, yeah, let's go check it out. My, uh, KD. Okay, so when you come downstairs, this is like the VIP section at the moment. They are going to open it up to like the public, but not yet, because this is like the special section. So down here, you've got brands like Louis Vuitton, like clothing, like hyped pieces, or not even hyped pieces, but pieces that sell out of these designer brands like slowly. And then once they're gone, they're like the most impossible pieces to find. Then they've got Gucci stuff, Fendi, so they've got all, all the Supreme, all the hype, all the sneakers. We all like sometimes to go for the Louis Vuittons and the Gucci's and the Dior. Look, they've even got like a big Dior section here. They've got tees, the uh, Dior Cause collab. This stuff for RIP to my one, we won't go into it, but I used to have this stuff for all types of super rare LV stuff. They even got Chanel runners in here. I did not know that they had Chanel runners. This LV bag is like takes see through to another level. But the coolest bit about this store is this. Oh, it's Ari Petru, and welcome to my crib. <laughs> no, this is not my crib. This, it feels like my crib though. This is a vibe. You got plate. Look at the size of this screen. Look at it. You play Warzone on this. What size TV is this? 100 inch? <laughs> They created a crazy vibe down in this store, honestly. Yeah, I'm just gonna play a couple games of Warzone right about now, and then uh, maybe we'll cop the Chunky Donkeys. Let's go! Easy dub, let's go! Easy, chilling, shopping, and catching dubs. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. So guys, we finished up at Boutique Ball and we came away with a fire, fire pickup. A pickup that I've been wanting for the longest time, so I'm gassed that I've managed to pick those up. I'm gonna outro this video right now because I low-key am um, gonna sit here and chill, play a bit of Warzone before I go home and edit up this video. But guys, if you did enjoy this video, I'd appreciate it if you could smash the like on it, subscribe if you are new to my channel as well, click that little notifications bell as well so you know straight away as soon as I post. Make sure you are following me on Instagram as well, at Ari Petro, and go and follow these guys on Instagram as well, it's at Boutique Baller. Guys, as I said, hopefully you did enjoy this video. Peace out.